Well, tonight we're getting our first listen to the 911 call for an ambulance to transport Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin to Walter Reed National Military Medical Center. The caller is heard asking the operator for no lights and no siren on the ambulance because, quote, we're trying to remain a little subtle. Now, this adds more questions to what the Pentagon was trying to hide about the defense secretary's illness. CBS's Weijia Jiang reports from the White House. 911, where is your emergency? Tonight, the 911 call just obtained by CBS News reveals an aide to Secretary of Defense Lloyd Austin asked the dispatcher to keep the emergency discreet. Can I ask, but can the ambulance not show up with lights and sirens? Um, we're trying to mm -hmm. remain a, a little subtle. Yeah, I understand. Um, yeah, usually when they turn into a residential neighborhood, they'll turn them off, uh, but they're required by law to run with them with the main street. The operator then asks for details about Austin's condition. Did he pass out or does he feel like he's going to pass out? Uh, no. Austin was taken to the hospital on New Year's Day with an infection that stemmed from complications after surgery to treat prostate cancer nearly two weeks earlier. In a statement, Austin's doctor said the secretary had severe pain in his leg, hip, and abdomen. I'm just curious if we need them to take him to Walter Reed Medical, is that a possibility? Um, let them know that when they get there. Like I said, I'm noting all this in the call. The 911 call adds to questions about why President Biden did not find out about Austin's hospitalization for three days. Neither did his deputy, who had taken over Austin's duties while she was on vacation in Puerto Rico. Despite calls for Austin's resignation, the president says he's not considering firing him. Do you have a confidence in Secretary Austin? I do. I'm sorry. I don't want to see was it a option to, I can't not to tell you earlier? Yes. But tonight, the Pentagon has not responded to our request for a comment about that 911 call. The inspector general, though, continues to investigate why it took Austin so long to disclose his hospitalization. Nora. Major Jang at the White House. Thank you.